In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create fishbone diagram or it's popularly called as Ishikawa diagram also. So uh, you can see here I have created this uh, diagram here. This is the, the fish head and this is the fish tail and in between I've just added the fishbone with the icons and then you can add what's the problem here. You can different type of problems, environment measurement, material machine, human method and then what is that uh, the cause for this okay so all those things uh, it can be added here or if you want you can just add more details also and if you have not subscribed to my channel powerpoint university please subscribe it now and make sure to enable the bell notification icon you can uh, join my telegram group with the help of this link and if you like to contribute to my channel you can do it through paypal or patreon the link is provided in the video description section so let's start the tutorial add a new slide go to view enable the guides go to insert shapes from the rectangles i'm going to select the right triangle draw the right triangle you can see here this much size then format shape go to shape outline make it no outline then right mouse click edit point we can see here three points that I'm going to take the top point and I'm just going to make it somewhat bent something like this you can see here and then you can make it a little curve from both the ends something like this you can see here let me just make it from the top also a little bit something like this and if you want you can just increase the size also and then I'm going to duplicate this by pressing ctrl D duplicate this one go to rotate and I'm going to make it flip vertical and then attach this one and select both of this press ctrl G to group it and again if you want to increase the size you can increase the size so this is the the fish head you can see something like this then I'm going to add the tail for that go to insert shapes from the basic shapes I'm going to select the right triangle just add the triangle I'm going to add the triangle something like this you can see here and then go to rotate and then I'm going to make it which is rotate right 90 degrees and then just put it exactly in the center if you want you can increase or decrease the size later on that can be done so shape outline I'm going to make it no outline let me just zoom in here now what I'm going to do is right mouse click edit points there are three points so I'm just going to add one point at the center so bring the cursor here right mouse click and click on add point so one point has been added and then just drag this inside you can see something like this and then right mouse click and make it a smooth point okay so it comes like this and then you can just bend it more down you can see here and this also you can just bring this down something like this all right you can see here so we end up getting a shape something like this and then i'm going to insert shapes select the line and draw the line from this end to this end and shape outline you can give some gray color and you can increase the weight something like this all right now let's add the fish bones so for that go to insert shapes i'm select the basic oval shape from the basic shapes you can see I just click it so again depending on the requirement you can increase or decrease the size shape outline make it no outline then I'm going to duplicate this press ctrl D hold the shift key reduce the size you can see here maybe this much size I'm going to put it here one press ctrl D and then exactly I'm going to put it here and then I'm going to attach this with one line go to insert shape select the line you can see here I'm just going to put the line here let me just zoom in I'm just going to increase the size and then shape outline you can just increase the weight a little bit you can see something like this and then press ctrl D bring this here and I can just rotate it you can see here flip horizontal so this is my I've added here now the next thing is I'm just going to select these circles press ctrl D to duplicate add it here you can see here something like this and then you want if you can add one more here so I'm just going to duplicate this 
reduce the size further by holding the shift key you can see here i'm just going to add it here and press ctrl d i'm just going to add at the bottom again make sure that it is properly aligned all right and then just add the line at the bottom ctrl d to duplicate again i can just reduce the size let me just zoom in and i'm going to put it here press ctrl d to duplicate bring it up and then again just go to format i'm just going to rotate it so this is the second bone and then i'm just going to duplicate this press ctrl d to duplicate and then i'm just adding the third bone here so depending on your requirement if you want you can just reduce the spaces and add more uh, options also so once this is done now it's time to do some colorings so starting with the head i'm just going to select this go to shape format shape fill i can just choose some light color here and again if you want you can just put the same color or you can make it somewhat uh, a bit darker also you can see here whichever color you feel better you can just add it so it is a little a bit darker let me just remove the guides and then for this i want to add some a different color combination you can see here maybe i can just give the dark orange and for this i'm going to select this and i'm going to select the gold color and the line also i'm going to give the same and this one again i'm selecting this and shape fill i'm going to give maybe a, a light green you can see here the lime green and the color also the same thing for the lines and for this and i'm going to select a somewhat darker color you can see here and again line also with that same color so the color also has been added now it's time to add the text now if you would like to add some eyes mouth or whatever you can just do it so for example insert shapes i'm going to select the the triangle draw the triangle shape outline make it no outline rotate you can see i'm just going to make it rotate left 90 degrees bring it exactly in the center something like this and then i'm going to make it a white color so you got this also and if you want you can just put a circle a small oval shape for the eyes now it's time to put the text here first of all go to insert text box i'm going to say this one as a1 all right and then i'm just going to put it here you can see here if you want you can make it bold also press center align and then press ctrl d to duplicate i'm just going to add later on we can change the text you can see here ctrl d now i'm going to add it here at the top and this one so this is a1 this is a2 this is b1 this is b2 and this is c2 and this is c1 you can see here and if you want any icons you can just go to insert icons and any good icons of your choice depending on the requirement you can just add it so let me just add some icons it's taking some time so you can see here i'm just randomly selecting some icons here click insert and then i'm going to reduce the height and width to 0.5 you can see here and then i'm just adding it on top of the bigger circle here all right and then it's time to add the detailed text for each fins so go to insert text so this is the main text you can just say here the problem one if you want you can just change the, i'm just going to say the hand of sean you can see here or any font you can just add it press ctrl d to duplicate add it here go for the second option this is for the third option again press ctrl d now just add it here add it here 
press ctrl d for which one you want to do it for example i'm just going to say this is the defect okay and then you can just add each detail here example issue one we can see here right aligned reduce the size like this you can just add as many options you want depending on the requirement you can see here just add one by one you can see let me just add it one by one maybe sometimes you need to add three also you can just add as per the requirement and then let me just add it here that's it with this we have done our design and if you like to add more uh, details or some animations you can just add the animation to it